We're all here. I guess we should send. Now the question is, how do we deliver the calling card to him? Yeah, we don't know where he lives. Hmm? Why not use the same method as before? One shot at this. Don't let your guard down. Well then. I see. Make sure you close up. Yes! All right. Oh! My God.
about you. This is it. That's correct. Excuse me, sir. Uh, I found this on the car. There's something written on it. Hmm? Read it. Um, but... I said, read it! <clears throat> sir Junya Kaneshiro, the money-devouring sinner of gluttony, you indulge in scamming others with horrendous methods that target miners exclusively. We have decided to make you confess all your crimes with your own mouth. We will take your distorted desires without fail. From the Phantom Thieves. I isn't this bad? What of it? I I if something happened to you, I mean, if the higher-ups find out about this, don't waste your time worrying about this useless shit. Just keep quiet for now. B but it's posted all around the city. People are talking about it online, too. <sighs> all of you, bring me your earnings. If you don't surpass your quota, I'll kill you. Y yes, sir. Phantom Thieves, don't make me laugh. Hey, we're leaving. They'll pay for this. The calling card's been posted all over Shibuya. A good idea, no? Given the theatrical nature of this one, Kanashiro must surely have been contacted about it. You truly are the brains of this Phantom Thieves operation. Ryuji, you should follow her example. Uh, you know, I'm the one who went posting it everywhere, right? I even had to get all dressed up so they wouldn't notice me. Come now, we don't have the time for idle chit-chat. Let us get moving. You're going up against a truly horrible criminal this time. That dick ain't gonna stop us now that we got our awesome new member. Makoto, you remember how all this works? Once we seal the treasure, the palace will crumble, and the palace ruler's heart will change. Wow, you got that quick. I think Ryuji's still struggling to comprehend it all. The old me is dead. Makoto the sycophant is gone, and the corrupt adults who controlled her are next. Sounds like you're fired up. All right, Joker. Give us the sig- It's showtime.
Let's go. Change the entire room so quickly. <laughs> I guess this palace isn't a bank for nothing. Greetings. Welcome to my private city bank. I'm surprised you made it here alive. It seems you're quite lucky. Lucky? Don't be ridiculous. We're gonna change your heart and make you confess everything you've done. That'll save all those people who are suffering because of your shitty actions. Even the police are struggling to deal with you. So this will make the public believe in us too. Those in power work the ones below them to the bone for money. Such is the hierarchy of the world. Just accept your fate as a source of my wealth. We'll never agree to that. And hierarchy? You have to be out of your mind. All of that was forced on me too, you know. I went through shit until I crawled my way out of the dregs. Now it's my turn to profit on everyone else. Still, don't you think you're getting back at the wrong people? What a pitiful man. It doesn't matter whether you're clean or dirty. Only the clever come out on top. The strong and the smart devour the weak. That is the natural order of things. You damn brats who think you know the world through the shit you read online. <laughs> he is utterly hopeless. It's always the fools who get tricked. Fools who have to pay for their foolishness. And if those fools don't learn, or they have to suck it up and stay as plain stupid fools. Will you just shut it already? I guess there's not much point saying anything to you fools. This is where my gracious lecture ends. Now then, I hope you're ready to work as slaves here for the rest of your lives. That's outrageous. <laughs> I'm gonna swarm all over you and squeeze out every last penny! Yeah. 
time for you all to go to hell! Damn it. I didn't expect he'd have something like this up his sleeve. Joker, have us regroup if you think we're at a disadvantage. We need to take down that giant robot. But we'll be in trouble if it attacks us when we're weakened. Get him, Joker! This money grubber's getting a one-way ticket to redemption! done. Kanashir tossing an expensive item his way might draw his attention and serve it. Let's give it a try, Joker. Let's try throwing this. <laughs> How's it? Let's try throwing this. How's what do you think of this, Joker? It might work. How's this? I worry that it Let's try throwing this. <laughs> Super expensive. Leave it to me. Oh, 
punish. Attack him. yourself hey guys their numbers may be growing but we Get ready! 
fucking rain and take this. Take this. I'm just a little short on bombs at the moment! These minions are nowhere to be- Shit! I screwed him! You're out of options here. I will- Come! Hold on. all from innocent fine I'll call off the dead fine you're still sounding pretty condescending you're right how am I supposed to live a normal life like this It's all because of our society! Weak people can't lead a happy life, no matter what they do! I'm a victim too, you know? Yeah, none of this is my fault! The more you talk, the more pathetic you sound. I just wanted a place where I could belong! You get that, don't you? Bullshit! All you did was surround yourself with people you could use, solely for some easy money! And you think you're the only one who's got to deal with being labeled? Me and all these other guys, we're all fighting against that! But don't worry, you'll finally have a place you belong. Somewhere you can make amends. For the rest of your life. We're gonna do something free of charge. I'm glad you understand. Now hurry up and return to the real Kaneshiro. Seriously? You guys don't have any tact. Especially with that incredible- These palaces could net you loads of cash! You could do whatever you want- We're not like you! <laughs> Where do you find meaning in that naive sin- You know, that... What? I'll let you in on a little something. There's a criminal using other people's palaces to accomplish whatever they damn well please. They don't care about consequences, psychotic breakdowns, mental shutdowns, anything goes. Is that the same person Madarame's shadow spoke of? talking about <laughs> don't even bother you are nothing compared to them better be careful that 
chance encounter with them could prove fatal. We can think about that later. Grab the treasure, there's no time. In that case, we should take that large one. Wait, what? What's gotten into him? This is so cool! Wowee! Being a human is great! It's, it's, it's shiny, shiny gold! Are you all right? Is yours cracked as well? Of course not! Isn't it supposed to be, though? Nobody was hurt. Uh, I wouldn't say nobody. That briefcase. It appears to have been the cause of Morgana's demise. That's not what I meant! Isn't that Kaneshiro's? You mean his treasure? Hey, the light's red! Where should we open it? about a karaoke we'd have security cameras to worry about there oh I got the perfect place that's right I was just in the mood for some coffee too and we need to fix Morgana up so warm This place is oddly calming. Have you learned anything new? It's sealed by a rotary lock. We'll need the combination to open it. Yeah! A rotary lock, huh? I knew it. How did you get that? I simply memorized the combination. I saw him open and close it so many times, after all. Well, that's scary. But amazing, too. One stack is one million yen.
Even after splitting it, we still each get five million! Holy shit! It's gonna be deluxe pork soup combo for me from here on out! You have to think bigger than that. Not to bring down the excited mood, but does this money look real to you? What? represents how everything he did was an act to make himself seem tough. No! <laughs> well, hey, at least it feels like we t What do you mean? Is busting a case good or bad? Both! To think the reward for the Phantom Thieves is feeling they totes busted the case. <laughs> ah, how funny. Uh, hold on a second. Even though the contents were nothing more than trash, the case itself is quite nice. All right then, let's sell it. <laughs> Glad we got that sorted. By the way, Morgana, have any of your memories returned? No, not at all. Come on, did that hit to your head make you forget even more? It's easy for you to talk. You're not the one who lost your memories. Like that. He does remember searching for treasures, though. Hmm. I hope your memories return soon, then. So, what happens next? First, we wait for Kaneshiro to have his change of heart. Ah, oh, it's gonna be big this time. People are gonna make a huge deal out of it for sure. Hey, you know what Kaneshiro said at the end there? About that criminal using the metaverse? Yes, I was bothered by that as well. No point mulling over it now. Let's wait and see how Kaneshiro's change of heart goes first. We should probably just lay low for a while. I never thought I'd hear those words coming from you. About my request. How long is it going to take? This incident happened at the school you're supposed to be presiding over. Excuse me, sir? We need to speak with you at once regarding the fishing organization operating out of Shibuya. Fine. I hope you remember who gave you that position to begin with. Our other operative gave us a list of candidates without delay. How different from a certain someone. Yes, of course. Please continue your investigation.
we need to do now is let the results come rolling in. We did great today, though. Public opinion of us should skyrocket after this. do it for now. Hey! That Kaneshiro truly was an evil stain on society. Same with Kamoshida and Matarame, too. They hurt and exploited others just to satisfy their desires. Still, there were people around them who noticed their terrible deeds, weren't there? I wonder why they turned a blind eye. Why doesn't anyone help? So it's because they don't have the courage. Humans are so weak. Humans. Hey, do you think I'll really be able to become a human? When I touch the treasure? Some memories came back. I tried to force myself to forget, but... I really may not be human. Talk about a lukewarm response. Now that I think about it, I gotta be human. I am the core of the Phantom Thieves, after all. good for you to stay up this late. Let's go to sleep. Our master wishes to speak with you. Heed his words. You've defeated the repulsive fiend of gluttony this time. <laughs> well done. I am glad to see you have devoted yourself to your rehabilitation. You are not worthy of such kind words, inmate. I suggest you treasure them. Do you re 
recall the whispers about that strange man. You forgot already? <sighs> this fool is beyond redemption. This is about the cases of those people who shut down, is it not? Indeed, I speak of another with powers similar to yours. If you are to complete your rehabilitation, you may encounter him eventually. <laughs> Yet another thing for me to look forward to. It would be greatly troubling if you were to not strengthen your abilities. I shall grant you an ability befitting of your newfound growth. Consider it a gift. Return to your world. Hello? It's me, Makoto. Were you sleeping? I should let you know. Kanashiro contacted me. Kanashiro? He said he's calling off our debt. It seems he's disposed of all the photographs as well. And, um... My sister and her team have taken him into custody. What?! It appears they did not want him to disappear, if you know what I mean. His group was called a Mafia, after all. I wouldn't put silencing him past them. Does this mean we were successful in changing his heart? It's hard to say for sure yet. I see. What about those psychotic breakdowns that Kanashiro mentioned? I'm not sure. But I assume he was talking about the incidents that have been all over the news lately. It really may be related to the other person who has been entering palaces. True. That said, all we can do now is wait until Kanashiro's change of heart becomes clear to us. Thank you. This humidity is overwhelming.
By the way, <laughs> may I get a word in? Yes. What is the matter? Go.
It seems I've become too passionate. I'm glad you were here. You have my thanks. You're like Theo. I was referring to Van Gogh's brother, Theo. Van Gogh did not achieve fame in his lifetime, but found an admirer and supporter in his brother. There aren't many who are willing to deal with my eccentricity. By the way, what's in your hand? A card? Hmm. Whenever I see blank paper, I have the urge to draw something on it. May I? <laughs> Impossible. Good. What? Hmm. A satisfactory result. Well, what do you think? Not bad, wouldn't you say? Soon enough, my slump will be a thing of... My picture turned into a real skill card? Indeed. Would you mind helping me further? If I can overcome this slump, I should be able to aid our group like earlier. Perhaps even more so. I know. Why don't we act as the Thebes we are and strike a deal? Great. I promise your returns will be well worth your cooperation. Multiple cards were discovered among your belongings, replicas of the same design. I don't have a clue how these cards were used, but someone proficient in the arts was close to you. What were you having this person do? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Emperor Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. We've done enough for today. I've completed a rough sketch. I'll finish this back at the door. I'll contact you once it's done. I'm in your debt. See you. Ah, you're back. Hey, inmate!
Everyone. your thoughts. I've been waiting. Any questions? Thanks in advance. Nice work.
wait! Good morning. For now. Oh, yeah. It's crazy how humid it is, huh? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's ignore that idiot. Striking an enemy with but a moment's inspiration? Skillful- Those might actually be good tactics to know for our work as the Phantom Thieves. You said she's at the church in Conda, right? We should check it out when you have the time. Moments of hope. Nothing left to be found. A mirror right in front of me. All right. An empty glass reflecting that's a truth. Stanley was the truth he told. I need them. Hey, hey! Thank <laughs> you. 
What? Yes? Can... Huh? Um... You don't necessarily... There are other options. Such as playing online. Sorry. I just can't. Well then... Um... So... You like Shoki? Like me? You're a bit strange, but thank you. Um. Okay, just a quick game then. 20 seconds per move, if that's alright with you. I'll start. So this is your skill level, huh? The dragon which governs the blue sky has fallen into my hands. How do you intend to survive this? Check. It's checkmate no matter how you look at it. Please concede. To concede is an act of admitting that you have lost with grace. If you aspire to become a shogi player, I recommend that you take your study of the game to heart. Thank you for playing. Well then... That will be all for today. If it's alright with you, may I request another match sometime? I feel... a gambler's spirit emanating from you, which is strange, since your style of play is that of a complete novice. Huh? Oh! However, I will instruct you you become my playing partner, so that I can research new moves. Is that agreeable? Thank you very Well then, it's a deal. I'll teach you how to play, and you'll assist me with my new moves. I think that quite advanced strategies are necessary to succeed at that many criminal acts. And yours weren't by the wit of an amateur. You had a professional who regularly deals with such tactics. You have an idea on who that is, don't you? that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the star persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. end here for today. Thank you for today.
Good morning. It's hot again. Konoshiro's deadline is drawing. We did all we could. I hope we can avoid problems now. As expected from someone who's been through this three times already. If you say so, then. Yes, I'm sure it'll go well. Yep, yep. Sir? That's good.
good effort. I was thinking... home now. Ah, you're back. Hey!
So, this is your room, huh? Hmm, how do I put this? Uh, never mind. So, the way you opposed Mr. Kamoshida, I'd say that you're earnest and have a strong sense of justice. That being said, you called a maid service and requested me? I see. Oh, that's right. You have a criminal record. Okay. Then, how about this? I'll let you skip class a few times. It's tough not having any place where you belong, isn't it? However, I reserve the right to change my mind if your grades drop. And in exchange, you won't tell anyone that I'm moonlighting as a maid. Sound good? Then it's a deal. I think you pulled off so many crimes while attending school. I can't believe you managed that by yourself. There had to be someone at the school helping you. What do you have to say to that? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Temperance Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. here with one of my well I guess I should get going oh please request me if you need any help with your housework that's clearly not true come on we know each other's secret and it would put my mind at ease Besides, I'm, uh, I'm considered over the hill for this type of job, so I don't get requested that. I'll show my appreciation by making it easy for you to ditch class. Just think about it, okay? Mm-hmm. 
Doesn't look like it'll work. Thank you very much. Now then.
Everyone. You. Mm. Hey. I'll see you again. Hey, hey! Thanks in advance. Who cares? No matter how hard they looked, even our organized crime department couldn't catch Junya Kaneshiro. And yet he simply turned himself in, even confessed all his crimes. Phantom Thieves. Is it a crime to manipulate someone's heart? Depending on the means, yes. He's absolutely right. Even if it makes someone admit their evil deeds and helps make them pay for their crimes? I hope she hasn't fallen under their influence. <sighs> the Phantom Thief. Damn it! Now everyone!
This is it. Very good. No way. Nice going. People have been making a huge deal of it since the police announcement. It's difficult to accept that the authorities are taking all of the credit for his arrest. People are going nuts about the Phantom Thieves online, though. Look! It's all coming together for us. Oh, this is quite the turnaround. All of a sudden, people are expressing their long-standing belief in us. So this is why Makoto told us to post the calling card anywhere that might stand out. Pretty smart move on her part. Oh, where is our amazing Miss President? Hello? It's Makoto. My apologies, but I, I won't be able to join you today. I've been called into a meeting with the principal. There's no need to worry, though. More importantly, there is a special on TV about the Phantom Thieves. Huh? What did it say? They were talking all about our calling cards. For real? Anyway, my apologies about today. I'll have to see you all another time. Who was that? Really? Oh, that's freaking crazy! Well, I hope all this excitement doesn't place us in the police's radar. It'll be fine! No way they'd find out about that weird other world. True, but do you remember what the fake Kaneshiro said towards the end? Yeah, he said we're not the only ones who are doing it. Eh, not gonna let it bother me. As far as we know, he was just pulling that shit out of his ass. I hope that's the case. Anyways, in your face, Akechi! Now, what do you want to do about our next target? Don't get ahead of yourself. Still, people might expect a lot from our next move, considering how excited they're getting. We can't just pick any old schmo now. There is no need to hurry, though. Counting Kamoshida, we've claimed three consecutive victories, right? We should just lay low and wait for all this excitement to blow over. In that case, how about we have another celebration? Oh, good idea! We can make it a welcoming party for Miss President, too! By the way, that briefcase, it's pretty damn expensive! Let's sell it and drop the cash on our party! Wow! Seems like the lay low and wait idea has gone completely out the window. So we can count you out then, Morgana? Uh, what are you talking about? I was just saying we should try and keep our party on the down low! <laughs> and that's the spirit! Well, I'm gonna let Makoto know. Hi, Makoto. There's something we forgot to tell you. So... Oh... What's wrong? Hello? I hope you remember we have finals next week. Yusuke and Morgana excluded, of course. Do you wish not to stand out? You had best not get bad grades, okay? That is something I simply would not be able to overlook as student council president. For now, behave and concentrate on your studies. We can have fun once finals are over. Understood? <sighs> Care to explain? I believe in what I wrote. The Phantom Thieves are just. Have you figured out who they are? No, I'm nowhere close. However, after considering all the facts, 
I concluded there are no errors in their acts or principle. Thus, upon deeming them to be on the side of justice, I have decided to end my investigation. But that's impossible! Impossible? May I see the evidence you have that leads you to believe so? <sighs> I was just speaking to the director of a prestigious college about your letter of recommendation, too. There will be no need for that. I intend on getting into a good college by my own merit. Please excuse me. Hey, we're not done here! <sighs> Sir, it's me. I apologize for bothering you like this about that. Yes, I am making progress. <laughs> However, I have stumbled upon some difficulties. Still, why would someone as important as you be interested in a petty case like this? No, that's not what I meant. I will investigate with all the resources available to me. Of course. Um, I should be able to let you know relatively soon. Yes, I will bring good news. Uh, well then, uh, thank you for your... Damn it! I'm home. Hi, sis. You look tired. Is everything okay? Don't worry about me. How about you, Makoto? Have you been keeping up with your studies? Yes, of course. Though... What is the point of studying? What do you mean? I was just wondering what will be waiting for me at the end. Even if I manage to push through tough entrance exams, I'm still thrust into a competitive society. What else is there besides success? Don't ask me such childish questions. Isn't this the man the Phantom Thieves sent a calling card for? I heard he confessed all his crimes. Even the police couldn't figure out why. It really... was out of nowhere. This would only make sense if his personality changed. That would be... Why does it matter? The police still caught him in the end, right? I had plans set for a promotion. But no one can take credit for his arrest now with that confession. Not that a child would understand. So she was pursuing the case after all. Promotion. You've changed, sis. But... I'll be okay. I finally found a place where I belong. Ah, you're back. teammate of ours is pretty promising. We'll be able to do even more now! Hey! Everyone, you. Hmm? 
if you'd like. Everyone. However, Thank you. I'm glad. Thank you. No. Well then, I shall see you again soon. Don't be ridiculous! new ally you gained was Makoto? Just tell me the truth! Suddenly gone quiet, huh? That's preposterous! If what you say is true... Was Makoto also running from the police when you were arrested? Now that I think about it, she did start talking a lot about the investigation from summer onward. Makoto aside, you mentioned one other important detail. Did Kanashiro really say there was someone using the Metaverse besides the Phantom Thieves? Those words could just be taken as you shifting blame to this other person, you know. But why would you fabricate such an elaborate story and then shift the blame elsewhere? There are two possibilities. Either you've simply been trying to confuse me with your lies, or everything you've stated is true. Have you been telling me the truth from the very start? That's the plan.
Then again, I am investigating a thief who steals hearts. Very well. No matter how absurd it may seem, I'll reevaluate my stance on believing you, for now. In return, speak the whole truth and nothing but the truth. It's a fair deal. Is that acceptable? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Judgment Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. We're running out of time. Let's move on to your next target. Actually, I should rephrase that. They targeted your group first, didn't they? The identity of your opponent is this. We have no pictures. Even their names and identities are unknown. If what you told me is true, then this nav thing you've mentioned wouldn't have worked in this case. How did you target them? Tell me everything. Hey, check the ingredients in the fridge. Hey, what's up? Huh? It's not right? Not cute? That was the one the staff recommended to me, though. Won't that printer do? Huh? It'll do, but it's not it? Okay, I'll be right over. This might take a while. I'm leaving the store to you. Lock up for me if I don't come back. Something like that. <laughs> what a handful. And that concludes the latest news on the suspect Kaneshiro. This case is said to be a result of the Phantom Thieves' actions, but what do you think? We don't know their methods, but I believe they are a menace that will threaten this law-abiding country. This dangerous group tampers with people's hearts. It's no different from brainwashing. I see. You're absolutely correct. I wonder what's going on. Didn't this happen a little while ago, too? Who was it again? You know, that famous artist. Ah, uh, Madarame, was it? They punished those awful people, didn't they? The Phantom Thieves aren't at fault then. Well, that may be true, but... Don't you think so too, dearie? The Phantom Thieves aren't doing anything wrong, are they? See, even he says that they're doing good. Oh my, look at the time. We should probably head home. Ah, you're right. Thanks for the drink. Yes, I've received the reports on Kaneshiro's case. But to think the Phantom Thieves would honestly attempt an absurd idea like social reform. You're absolutely right. I'm not pleased about the general public's support of them either. The 
there's also the danger of the metaverse being exposed with their continued actions. Actually, there is one countermeasure he brought in that seems usable. It involves having the Phantom Thieves destroy themselves without our direct intervention. We'll set things up so that those mental shutdown occurrences are their doing. I thought as much. I had a feeling that it was too brutal for it to be his own idea. Still, to think you'd go through such elaborate detail to crush them. Their actions must be that much of an eyesore for you. I sympathize with what you're going through. Well then, I'll clean this up quickly and put it behind us. Yes. A grand undertaking like social reform is beyond a group such as the Phantom Thieves. Only a select few are worthy of changing the world. And who better than the future Prime Minister, sir? for finals why am I here too you're one of us now so of course you got to help us we're in trouble if you don't teach us you know <sighs> let's leave those guys be I couldn't ask the last time I was here, but what is this place? The storekeeper doesn't seem to be around. It's where this guy lives. He's got complicated circumstances. We can tell her about it, right? Actually, tell yourself. That's... that's terrible. On Yusuke and me are pretty much the same too. I mean, <laughs> it's not as bad as this guy's though. It's just something we can't ever put up with. That's why we all became Phantom Thieves. Hey, don't forget me. I know, I know. We're all part of the team. By the way, Makoto, ain't there someone you can't forgive either? Like, a heart you want to change? That's the secret. Ah, there's someone like that. You could just tell us, you know. You don't gotta be so cold. That aside. Do you have any intention of studying for the exams? Not really. It's fine if I leave then? No, no, I I'm just joking. P please teach us. Hmm, what was this term? It's phobia, so it's a fear of some kind. I think it's a fear of open spaces. You don't hear it that often, though. Leave vocabulary and long sentences to me. I suck at proper grammar, though. Duh, even if we study English, it's not like I'm gonna use it in the future. When it comes to you, your Japanese is questionable, too. Ah, uh, shut up! Explain the writer's feelings? What point is there in that? Oh, it's impossible. I can't memorize all these formulas. Ain't there a good way of cheating? <sighs> Why don't we take a break? And that was the follow-up report on the suspect Kaneshiro. Now, Akechi-san. This case is said to be the result of the Phantom Thieves' actions, but in actuality, is this true? Considering how a calling card was scattered about, 
I believe there's no mistaking that. The question is what the Phantom Thieves actually did. If they tampered with the suspect's heart, it casts doubt on the authenticity of any confession. So then, by tampering with hearts, the Phantom Thieves are fabricating crimes that may not exist? We can't deny the possibility. There's no doubt that the Phantom Thieves are exposing hidden injustices in society. However, if this is done by sidestepping the law, their way of thinking is very dangerous. So, in a way, they're outlaws. Yes. They're no different than the criminals they target. This cannot be overlooked. I see. Oh, I see. My ass. Why the hell are we being treated as the bad guys? Just let them say whatever they want. More people are starting to understand that what we're doing is right, after all. When I'm walking around in town, I hear a lot more people talking about us, too. And Don't get pompous over dealing with some street thug. Save it for after we deal with a bigger target. We just gotta take down a bigger one, yeah? That was the plan from the start anyways. True. It may be best if we start thinking about it. I bet we'll find one in no time. The wind's blowing in our direction and everything. I feel like we won't lose to anything right now. Well, we'll decide on that eventually. We need to overcome our exams first. Now then, break time's over. Let's get back to... That reminds me! The celebration party! Weren't we gonna do it after exams? Yes, I believe so. Where should we go? I feel like I'll study better if I got something to look forward to. The last one was a buffet at a hotel. We haven't gone anywhere since. Hmm? A buffet? Hmm, where would be good? Hey, what about fireworks? A fireworks festival! Oh, yeah! It's that season, huh? <laughs> that sounds good to me. It's hard to ignore a buffet, but... I'll take the beauties of summer. Still, I demand that we feast during the festival as well. Do you guys own a yukata? Will you wear a yukata? Doesn't a fireworks festival sound good? Uh, you think so too, right? Alright, fireworks festival it is. <laughs> Let's look for a good one. Study comes first, though. I won't let you off if you fail any of them. Are we clear? Yes, ma'am. All right, fireworks festival it is. Let's look for a good one. Study comes first, though. I won't let you off if you fail any of them. Are we clear? Yes, ma'am. <laughs>
a refreshing morning. How are you doing? I didn't expect the Phantom Thieves would suppress a man that even the police had trouble with. The fact they have so much support online is worrisome. I'm in a bind since I previously denounced them. All the interviews these days ask me about that. Still, can we really say the Phantom Thieves are on the side of justice with just this example? <laughs> oh, thank you. But I noticed that you're not saying that the Phantom Thieves are right. I suppose that was an unfair way to phrase it. I was originally investigating the mental shutdown incidents. Don't you think it's similar to the change of heart that the Phantom Thieves are doing? Hmm. Now that I think about it, their actions mirror the mental shutdown cases with the rate of victims. It's impossible not to see a connection there. Ah, sorry. I don't want to make you late. I'll see you again. Okay, let's get started. Hmm. How about you? This is it. That's right. Hey, are you listening? Pay attention! Excuse me. <laughs> 
<laughs> but... All right, then. Senpai! What a pleasant surprise! Are you headed home, too? Same here. I don't have club practice today. That reminds me. There's something I wanted to report to you. Would now be a good time? Thank you. Why don't we find a seat somewhere? Huh? And you are... It's been quite a while, Akechi-san. And the same for you. Yoshizawa-san, right? My father works at a TV station. Have you ever seen Good Morning Japan? My father's the director. I've been brought onto the show as a guest a number of times now. That's how I ended up becoming acquainted with Yoshizawa-san. I didn't know you knew her as well. He helped me out of a jam before, and now he's been offering me guidance. Helped you out of a jam, huh? So, what were you two up to? Oh, right! I was just about to share some exciting news. It's nothing to keep secret, so I may as well spill it now. About that summer competition I mentioned to you before, I was chosen to be our club representative. This only feels like the beginning to me, though. Isn't your club's team considered to be quite prestigious? And you're their representative. I must say, that's extremely impressive. Thank you. I'll do my best to make everyone proud. I'll be cheering you on as well. Ah, I have an idea. Since all three of us are here, why don't we go somewhere as a group? We can call it our little celebration for Yoshizawa-san's success. That would be wonderful! Does that work for you, Senpai? That settles it. Would you mind if I chose the place? There's a wonderful little cafe I know about. Of course. Lead the way. Yoshizawa-san? You drink hot beverages even in the summer? I have to prevent my body from getting too cold, since the meat's coming up rather soon. I see. You make sure you're covering all your bases. Good point. Well, some people say coffee can cool you off, even when hot, so I try to avoid that, too. I had this image that you enjoy sweet things, Akechi-san. Is that untrue? I swear I saw you eating fried sweetbread on TV just the other day. It's all part of a marketing strategy. That sort of stunt is an easy crowd pleaser. You seem to have your own bases covered as well. <laughs> You're more innocent than I had expected. I've been wondering, how do you two know each other? His social studies class visited the set of the TV show I appeared on. Ah, that's right. Second year's got to go to a TV station. He and I exchanged our opinions during the shoot, and his way of thinking intrigued me. I can definitely see that. Senpai's take on things often helps me as well. That reminds me, Yoshizawa-san. You had mentioned that he's been providing you with some guidance. Yes. Like you just said, his way of thinking is intriguing. I figured I could benefit from his input. In that case, let's play a little game. Would you mind if I pose the same question to you that I first asked him? No, go right ahead. So, my question was, what do you think of the Phantom Thieves, Yoshizawa-san? The Phantom Thieves? You mean in the case that they do in fact exist, yes? I admit that the assistance of others in need is a truly great act, but I simply can't agree with their methods. I see. Care to explain why? I suspect the Phantom Thieves' existence isn't going to be beneficial to society in the long run. How so? Well, for example, when someone's faced with a problem to overcome, I believe they need to do it themselves. Getting help from others is totally fine, but in the end, it takes a person's initiative to truly create lasting change. 
If society relied upon a safety net like the Phantom Thieves, I worry that people would stop making a conscious effort. Granted, this depends on how severe the problem is, and it's inaccurate to apply generalizations to an entire population. But I believe a society where everyone simply leaves matters to the Phantom Thieves wouldn't last for very long. I see. So, in the sense of a person's growth, their actions actually hinder it. Quite an interesting take on the matter. Let me ask you then, what do you think of Yoshizawa-san's opinion? Ah, so you think you should let others come to their own conclusions on the matter. Wait, could you actually be a fan of the Phantom Thieves, Senpai? <laughs> I didn't mean to start an argument. I just can't help myself sometimes. Let's change the subject to something a bit lighter. I'm sorry, I should probably get going. If I'm away from home too late, my parents will begin to worry. Right, then let's call it a day. Good luck on your competition. Yes, thank you. Well then, see you later. Ah, you're back. I should write something. 